Hello guys and welcome back to my channel with another video and guess what I am traveling yes I am traveling I am traveling to Jaipur and it's really early morning and I need to catch my flight so I'll be there for around three days around three nights so there are a lot of things planned and we'll see how much it works out based on the weather how it is there and you know if it's rain too much or whether it's too much of sunny I don't know so we'll see how it goes and that's me um, my mood is really off because subay subay I haven't got my tea yet so that's the reason I'm a little pissed off so we reached airport security check done baggage dropped now I'm looking forward to have some food and some tea to charge myself so breakfast done I ordered some dosa and I had my tea and we are waiting uh, for the boarding time in a to begin so that uh, we can board the flight and um, we are much prior to the time so we're just chilling at the airport and taking some selfies some random pics some random clicks so that's it yes boarding completes and here we are gonna take off So we landed in Jaipur and we are heading towards the um, baggage claim to get the luggages. The airport is pretty small, um, not as big as compared to the Bangalore airport or any other airport but it's pretty neat, clean and uh, it's good. It's, it's better than the Amritsar airport at least. So at least we have few shops, few things to eat and drink where Amritsar airport was not that great. So we booked our Uber in advance and uh, the place where we are staying it's uh, basically a very old uh, what do you call a heritage property it's uh, some some old palace um, and it's not that too far from the airport also so plan is to um, first go to the Reach Hotel uh, we're gonna eat some food because it's almost gonna be lunch time and then we'll take some rest and then we'll head out and we'll explore Jaipur couple of things are planned I just hope it works accordingly and yeah so as you know we just go and we'll take you guys along with us as well so that's the sneak peek of the uh, Shahpura palace that I am staying so there's a total uh, video of uh, the hotel which I've taken and I've already uploaded so you guys can go and check it out it will be there, the link will be given in the description box so just go and you can just have a look to it, it's really really beautiful. So for lunch I ordered some paneer, oh it looks so amazing, craving for paneer, uh, rice and the famous Jaipur Lalmas which is like I've never tasted before. Okay this, so the food was really good and I slept out, I really slept good in one, one, two hours and now we are all dressed and we are heading towards to Jaipur and here I'm trying to speak and my friends are disturbing me from back so the moment I switch on the camera they are just saying something or the other and I'm just getting distracted so finally we are in Jaipur and right now we're in the auto rickshaw we are heading towards Hawa Mahal so um, the plan for today will be like uh, we move into Hawa Mahal and we'll do a couple of shopping maybe we'll cover a few of uh, Johri Bazaar side and Chanpur Bazaar as well as Babu Bazaar I have a lot of things to shop so let's see how it goes and uh, as we complete each of them uh, we'll take you along with us. So we are at the market area and this both the side you can see that it's fully like shopping place. So there are too many bazaars in Jaipur to shop and you get the best things out here. Jaipur is known for his shoppings, for his bangles, shoes, earrings, kurtas, dupattas, whatever you want to buy, just name it and you get it. 
but also with that you need to be a good uh, you know person to bargain a lot you can get things with 50 rupees 100 rupees to 1000 to you know like 50000 also so as you can see like both the side all the buildings are painted with pink um jaipur takes his pride in um, you know this legacy of uh, the pink color that is uh, painted uh, to the buildings and uh, the residential areas and everywhere uh, it is often said that um, it was painted pink to welcome queen victoria's husband prince albert and that gives jaipur its status as a pink city So we decided that we will go to Hawa Mahal and we will start our shopping after that because it was almost 5 o'clock and sorry it's almost uh, it's gonna close at 5 so it is open I think from 9 o'clock in the morning till 5 o'clock in the evening and uh, so we decided that we will finish with the Hawa Mahal first we will give a small tour and everything and then we will start our shopping and all. So the entry ticket for Hawa Mahal was around 50 bucks. Um, that's pretty pretty cheap and it's 200 for the foreigners and um, it's open from 9 30 in the morning till evening five o'clock and so it takes around one hour to one and a half an hour for you to roam the entire you know mahal it depends like how much you know you stop in between you take pictures and all those stuffs and video and everything but there's nothing much to see here uh, what i felt personally so it didn't take much of time to me to you know have a tour of this uh, hava mahal and also there are a lot of things inside that you'll get to see like puppet shows and few are singing some there's some folk music some folk dance performances and all those things also goes on so it's a good place to enjoy uh, but i will prefer all of you to come in the evening time um like uh, of obviously before five before four you should come and i think that time the weather will also be little you know uh, on the lighter note so you can enjoy the tour Built in 1799, Hawa Mahal or the Palace of Winds has 953 intricately designed windows situated on its outside walls. These windows are also called Jharukhas. The gorgeous red and pink sandstone windows are perfectly shaped to allow free flow of breeze through the palace making summers seem more cool and pleasant. The palace is situated on the edge of the city palace Jaipur and extends to the Zinana or women's chamber. As per Rajput law, the royal ladies could not be seen by strangers and were not allowed to appear in public places. With the help of this palace, the ladies could easily be party to the royal processions from a distance without being seen or noticed. It is notable to say that that woman could observe all the events happening around them without coming in contact with the strangers. But what makes Hawa Mahal so special? The architectural marvel till date stands to be regaled by many historians and architects worldwide for its unique cool air system inspired from the Venturi effect. The cooling effect is further enhanced by fountains located at the center of each of the chambers. This makes it a perfect retreat to beat the heat in the sweltering summers of Rajasthan. The five storied pyramid shaped monument is about 50 feet high and combines the best of rajput style architecture and islamic mughal architecture in short the uniqueness of the hawa mahal in jaipur attracts millions of tourists around the year to marvel and get delighted by one of the most outstanding structures of the 18th century so we are done with the tour of the Hawa Mahal and now is the best part that begins at the shopping part. So but before that Jaipur Ai or Lassi na pi ye to nahi sakta. So we decided to have a glass of Lassi and in this hot after uh, roaming for one to two hours for uh, you know the palace tour if you get something cold to drink it's like uh, heaven. So 
started drinking the yummy lassi i started my shopping so um there'll be a detailed vlog of you know only for jaipur shopping uh, what all i purchased at what price and where you should go and shopping or kahan aapko kya kya milega the best price so here i'm just going to give you a little sneak peek into um you know what kind of things you get here so you will get here you know bangles uh, you know dresses uh, all the minakari work jewelries and a uh, lot of dupattas and kurtas and bed sheets and all uh, traditional um, stuff so this streets that you see it's completely like both the sides of the streets are just for shopping so and all the bazaar are inter interlinked and interconnected so it our hums we we couldn't even realize how we just spend you know 3 to 4 hours in the shopping in the shopping and um, by the time we were done it was almost night uh, it doesn't look like um, but here was almost like eight o'clock um, when we are done with the stuff so we decided like uh, you know to head towards a hotel because we have couple of things planned in the hotel for that day and we were really tired because we traveled also on the same day so and while going <laughs> we have taken this uh, tuk tuk rickshaw or something and i am sitting on the rickshaw after a very very long time and something goes wrong but what happens and how it happened you'll get to know only in the you know part 2 of the jaipur series so stay tuned please do watch my vlogs uh, if you like this video please do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification icon as well so that as i upload videos you people are the first one to be notified uh, do subscribe to the cha channel and uh, and support my channel thank you